Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sharnice and welcome to Simply Nikva. Today is the second part on how I do my fashion illustrations from beginning to end. If you missed the first part, I showed you how to draw a nine-headed figure, fashion corky or corcus as I learned in school. So now today in this video is all about the drawing. So if you want to see more, sit back, relax, and continue watching. But if you're new here, go down below and please subscribe to my YouTube channel and like this video. But other than that, let's get started with this video. So before we get into the drawing, let's talk about like the types of paper. So the type of medium that I'm going to use to color in my fashion illustrations, I use primarily markers and we get into markers when into the third video. So I use a marker paper to draw my sketch on. So if you want to use like watercolors or something like that, you want to use that type of paper and or you have like a, a multimedia paper so you can use multiple different types of medias. You can get marker paper at Walmart, at Hobby Lobby, at Michaels, anywhere that sells like crafty stuff. You can get some marker paper. A particular marker paper that I have is called Master's Touch a fine art studio marker pad paper and it costs only nine dollars and I got that from Hobby Lobby so you choose what you need so let's get into the drawing so what I do instead of drawing like the nine headed figure every single time I want to uh, draw a sketch I will place that paper at the bottom and then place the marker paper right on top so I have that outline of the, the, the fashion corcus figure and then I, I can just go ahead and I will still be tracing the body but also tracing with the clothes on so I won't have to do all these multiple things every single time I want to draw a fashion illustration. Yeah, I just wanna go back home. Can't do this anymore. I can't get through to you, so what the fuck am I fighting? Now you want to draw your design. That part is your creative feel to it. So, um, I will give you some tips as you watch me draw this beautiful design I thought up today. You really just need to look up any kind of like reference pictures, any kind of um, styles that you want to draw this time um, with your picture. So if you want something ruffled, look up like ruffle skirt or something like that. Something specific that you're trying to do on your particular fashion illustration so you can mimic that um, flow and that shape onto your drawing. You can see how it fits on the body, on a 3D body, and how it fits and you can draw and mimic that 3Dness onto the body when you draw it. Also want to look at reference pictures to see this have inspiration of what you want to draw as well. That's what I do as well, just look at different different things. Usually just ideas pop in my head from what I've seen and then bam this drawing comes to life and it's so cool sometimes you have to go through one drawing and then start all over because it just didn't come out right like this specific one I thought of something first but then I scratched that whole design and did this one and I'm so glad that I did this one for you guys this week but other than that you just draw what your heart desires and that's what I do every single time so you just gotta choose and pick what you want I just want to really emphasize on the design of the clothes for this video. So you guys, I know this is like a little video and something simple and easy. It's self-explanatory really to draw, but it's a little bit informational on how I do my fashion illustrations. And this is step two what I, in what I do. So if you don't want to miss out on me coloring this beautiful design, this beautiful fashion illustration, go down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you like this little drawing video, go down below and like this video. If you want to see more like this, and I can give more technique videos on how to do specific styles so if you want that leave a comment down below or like this video and i will know so thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss out on part three of me coloring this beautiful fashion illustration but other than that thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you back next week with an awesome video you don't want to miss out bye